up. So I don't know how well you all can see this, but we're at the uh, recycle center and there is a ton of birds circling around the landfill here. The, the uh, attendant at the door just suggested that they were trying to reenact the movie, The Birds. We are at the recycle plant here in Lynn County. It's kind of nifty because it's a fully up-to-date, but it doesn't have uh, the conveyor belt system to separate out. It all goes commingled. Only two things you actually can't recycle here is styrofoam and Christmas wrap. So today it's the 19th? 18th. No, 19th. Saturday the 19th. We're on our way to church uh, for the Open and Affirming, or ONA, uh, Q&A session for anybody who wants. Uh, they can ask about what ONA means, what the process is. Are, are they allowed to ask questions about LGBT lifestyles? Limited questions. Um, no one gets to ask whether or not we're a top or a bottom. Very, very naughty. Yeah, so we're also going to get a rug scrubber tonight. It's about time. I, I, we were supposed to scrub them back at Thanksgiving. Uh, however, I went a little cuckoo uh, and forbid, forbade Mother Anderson uh, because I thought she was being pushy, but I forgot that we had already prearranged that when we first moved in. My bad. Sorry, Mother Anderson. Uh, it, it's time. It's spring cleaning. We have a possibility of housing a hockey player. Uh, so our meeting will be with the team on Monday. We've got the garage sale uh, this weekend. So we're hoping that some of our scrapbooking stuff uh, will sell at Scrap Mania because it's Scrap Mania's garage sale. So, yeah, Mike, you want to add anything? First things first. Food. <laughs> yes. So, more later. So, just got done cleaning the carpets in our smaller bedroom, which we're going to convert now to our office. Uh, as Toby was mentioning, we are in the application process to house a Rough Rider player next year. So, we kind of thought, well, why don't we convert the bedroom that we had been using as our office into that player's bedroom, give them a little bit more space, they still get the spare bathroom and we'll convert our office into the smaller bedroom and <clears throat> so but that also leads to the fact that we've wanted to clean the carpets since we've moved in here because we weren't totally sure if they were or not but either way hey they are getting done so first things first it was to clean it out and now vacuum and so i'm going to try and switch back to the front view oh uh Actually, I don't think I can. So let me just uh, pause here for a moment and show you the carpets after they have been rug doctored. Okay, it is Saturday, whatever the hell day this is, and I'm at work. Um, that's because I got called in. Apparently, at least one of our cashiers had called out. Uh, I got the message about an hour before, well, an hour after they called, and away I went. It has been hell. We've been on five cashiers the whole time. Of course, we've had registers problems, scanning on problems, everything that you could think of. I'm taking a 10 minute break because they were nice to me. <sighs> I'm here for another hour, but it's been hell. Yeah, it's been a good day so far. Had the ONA meeting at church. Uh, it was all people who seemed to be voting yes anyway. Uh, and none of the people that may have had a question, we had some good talk, good debate. To the Rog Doctor, Mikey may be working on one of the rooms. I like you guys today. Like I said, oh my god, have we been busy. Talk to you later. Bye. Looks pretty good in, in my opinion. And let me give you a kind of a point of comparison. So here's, here's the small bedroom, the one that will become the office, versus the living room carpet. Yeah, it's the same shade, but... I think you can tell it's a little bit lighter just with all of the dirt and dust and you know not that we don't vacuum but 
you can only vacuum so much before you actually do need to clean the carpet. So once the rug's dry, we'll put stuff back in there. We'll start making the conversion. So out and about again, I uh, got to run to the recycling center one more time because we're getting rid of our old printer that kind of went to pot on us. And then I got to head over to Michael's to pick up Toby. I'm, I'm ultimately kind of surprised because I really thought that um, it was going to take a long time to learn how to use the rug doctor and get all the steam cleaning done, but I want to say that just doing that, that little room probably took maybe a half hour to 20 minutes. That's, you know, give or take, I really didn't time it. It, but I'm, as I said, I'm really impressed with the way the, the carpet looks now. It doesn't look as as dingy. Yeah. So, <clears throat> of course, now comes the fun part of putting the house back together and finishing up everything else that we need to do. Move it to the switch and maybe get it done before tomorrow. Well, tomorrow is Palm Sunday. Hey, start of Holy Week. It's going to, I think it's going to be a busy week, but we'll see. I just had to shoot some footage of this. This is too awesome. Um, on the left, see some gorgeous clouds, and on the right, just like a straight, vertical line, clouds, dark, rain, possibly rain. Mother Nature can be really weird some days, and, and you just have to love it, because you never know what to expect, you never know how this is all going to turn out, except that it'll happen. Mm -hmm.